Dude, I gotta be honest, I, I hate how scared I'm getting as I get older. I'm developing all these new fears. Like, I have a fear of flying now. I never had a fear of it. It's not straight across the board flying. I don't like small planes all of a sudden. I just don't like them. It has nothing to do with the plane. I believe in the planes, okay? I just don't believe in the pilots. Because <laughs> you know why? I don't think the airline does either. <laughs> Which is why that dude is flying that little plane. <laughs> the airline was basically like, all right, we'll give you like 28 people. <laughs> See how you do, you know? You fly them out, you land, you bring another 28 back. We'll, we'll let you do this for a while. You do this for a while, we don't get any complaints. No up and down, up and down, no, none of that shit. We'll move you up to 35 people, and then one day you'll be in a jet, and woo, we're going a little faster, right? <laughs> Big planes, you're getting the fucking pilot that knows what he's doing. He's probably fought in a war. He's used to getting shot at. He can't bring this bus in. It's a joke, right? <laughs> Bunch of people whining in the back. Hey, my headphones don't work. He doesn't give a fuck, right? He's up there sleeping. He's trying to make something happen. He's so goddamn bored. That's a stud up there, right? So one time I'm flying into Albany, New York, okay? A city that nobody really goes to. So I'm on a smaller plane and everything's going great. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, we hit this turbulence. Just <laughs> right? And it stops. And everybody looks around like laughing nervously, like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 All of a sudden, it comes back with a vengeance. <laughs> you can literally hear like the metal the plane's made out of. Like, <laughs> All of a sudden, this dude, like three rows back, starts making like these bitchy noises, like, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not gonna lie, I have never been so fucking scared in my entire life. Dude, that noise is acceptable out of a female or a child. <laughs> to turn around and see a 37-year-old mustachioed male going, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Dude, the hair was standing up on my arms. I'm praying to a higher power. I don't even believe in the shit. I just wish I had the balls to turn around and be like, dude, would you shut the fuck up? <laughs> Jesus Christ, be a man, push it down. Push it down, deny your feelings, act like you have answers. Do some man shit right now. Do some man shit. Jesus Christ. You know, you think I'm not up here thinking, oh, ah, I am. But how does that help us for me to join you and turn this fuselage into a haunted house? You know? And you know what kills me? What absolutely kills me is some woman is gonna fall in love with this guy. Marry him and make half ooh, ooh, ah, fucking kids. And you know what? We become weaker as a species. We do. Do you remember? Do you remember back in the day when you watched the Discovery Channel? It was about animals. Now they build cars, but it used to be, it used to be about animals, right? Now it's all car stuff. Looking forward to getting that carburetor today, and then the carburetor didn't fit. What do you mean the carburetor doesn't fit? Carburetor doesn't fit. Dad's gonna be mad. I'm gonna fuck carburetor doesn't fit. My car is just done my fucking stairs there. You know, there's never enough time to build the car. It's so fucking stupid. We gotta have this bus done by Thursday. <laughs> or else what? The guy doesn't want it anymore? All right? You'll get the thing when we finish it, okay? This is a safety issue. We got to, you want brakes on it? Then go get yourself some fucking lunch. So, before, before, they used to just, you used to just be animals. And this is what I noticed. Everything from a lion all the way down to an insect, okay? If you had one drop of uh, uh, bitchy blood in you, none of the females would fuck you. That was it, your life was over. Your life, was over. No ant pussy for you, your entire miserable eight-day ant life, because all six of your legs shook when the wind blew and the female ant saw it. They're like, all right, stay away from that one. Stay away from that one. He's gonna, he's gonna jeopardize the whole hill. And Stacy, listen to me. Yeah. Human beings have empathy. Some woman will fall in love. Well, he's nice. He wears this sweater, he likes to bake, you know. 
he lets me finish my stories. <laughs> Which is all great qualities, okay? But you gotta know, when you shack up with a guy like that, you're, you're rolling the dice. <laughs> you're rolling the dice that that fucking axe murderer is gonna pick the next house over. Because God forbid he picks your goddamn house. This is the dude who has your back, who's gonna be screaming louder and higher than you when this guy comes through the fucking door and you're gonna turn around and all you're gonna see is his cowardly feet going out the kitchen window? I don't know, man, that's risky.